everybody, it is Dr. Steve coming to you from the Phoenix Mountain Preserve in Phoenix, Arizona. And behind me is the ascent up to Squaw Peak. Uh, it's called something else now, but it's, it used to be Squaw Peak. That's how people around here know it. And this is awesome. I've been out here for, this is my fourth day out here, and I've been here for training with one of the world leaders in posture therapy, Dr. Pavel Kolaj. Uh, he came in with two of his assistants from Prague and the Czech Republic, and there were several assistants from the States, so it was absolutely amazing. This guy has got it down. He has figured out the ideal posture based on infant development. And he has basically said that the whole idea of doing, you know, retractions and you know rows and uh, military posture and you know he's talking about this kind of posture is the worst kind of posture you can have when your chest is up and all your energy spills out he says when you're a baby you start developing low you can breathe low into your center you can brace very low one of the cues he used all weekend was to breathe into your groin no, not this one, this one. <laughs> it was great. He had broken English, but his, his assistant, uh, Dr. Elena, was just, she was amazing, and she has taken this whole idea of dynamic neuromuscular stabilization and has basically taken his work, who he, went before him, Professor Voita, found out that he could stimulate little areas or stimulate areas on babies who had cerebral palsy and he could stimulate normal movement patterns in kids with CP and actually you can stimulate them on anyone and now Professor Collage has taken that and turned it into a whole new program where you can actually use that to help people kind of refine their core without having them have to think about it at all. It is absolutely amazing. The whole second and third day we spent learning these zones and how to stimulate them and we saw amazing things happen. I saw actually, uh, I saw a guy come in, involuntarily come up off the table and start moving without consciously doing it. It's just, it, it evokes, it's this, these areas are the same areas that we used as support, or a lot of them are, are the same areas that we used as support when we developed from a baby to standing up. And we can stimulate these zones and reawaken those same organic posture patterns. So this is very groundbreaking stuff and I'm just so unbelievably excited to start using this and practicing it and teaching it and teaching it to my people online. I've got over a thousand people who get my emails every week and they're going to get this stuff firsthand. Uh, in my course, they're going to get even more of this and I'm just so excited to share this with the world now and just to understand that you don't have to suffer with pain your whole life because of poor posture patterns. You know, the reason we get into this, what he calls central coordination, uh, excuse me, CCD, central coordination disturbance, where the body kind of goes back and reverts to these old uh, uh, newborn patterns where the body is up and shrugged and very immature. And, in, you know, it's basically the stress patterns that I talk about with cross posture syndrome. Those cro the cross posture syndrome draws you forward and any kind of stress in your life will cause you to revert back to your your newborn stage but what we want you to be is more like your four-year-old stage after your patterns have all coordinated and come together and you've got you've reached this perfect posture pattern and there's no shrugging there's no losing your power through your center there's no inspiratory chest position so I'm just telling you this is absolutely incredible stuff and uh, so stay tuned we're going to teach you a lot more about it okay so until next time you keep thinking good thoughts, eating good food, and keep moving like a four-year-old, <laughs> all right? And we'll see you next time.